Hey everybody, welcome back. David Eon and the stunning Miss Lady Pop Hunter here with another weekly roundup, taking a look at some of what's hitting the adult action figure market eventually. <laughs> but first, of course, announcements. Uh, some of the shows that are coming up that we may be able to attend thinking about it yeah the original Atlantic comic convention coming up July 14th July 14th that's in two weeks from 11 to 5 and that's in Atlanta Georgia Atlanta record and CD show at the yes. IMAW Union Hall in Marietta the very following week on Sunday July 21st mm -hmm. the toy swap meet retro swap August 3rd from 10 to 3 in Powder Springs. Yeah, it's a good show. It is. It's a it's a real underrated show. Yeah. Farley Con, August 3rd and 4th. Yeah. And if we go to Far Farley Con, it's going to be on the 4th. Yeah. Um, Because normally when we go to shows, we go on a Sunday, plus mm -hmm. the toy swap is that Saturday. Yes. So. And that's at East Ridge, Tennessee, obviously. Yeah. Joe Lanta, September 22nd, or excuse me, 27th through the 29th mm -hmm. in Duluth, Georgia. Larger venue this year. Yeah. Looking forward to that. Cartersville Comic Con, October 12th in Cartersville, Georgia. Yeah. Then the Retro Toy Convention, November 22nd through the 24th in Greenville, South Carolina. And then wrapping it up at the end of the year, so far, so far, the Conyers Toy and Comic Show, which is December 8th at the American Legion Post in Conyers, Georgia. Okay. So there we are. Oh, look at that. Yeah, this is cute. Uh, starting off with Boss Fight Studios, mm -hmm. and these are four inches tall. Okay. Garfield action figures. Mm. He's got his little teddy bear and his lasagna and everything. Then they got eye plate change -outs. Yeah, it, it's an eye plate change -out. <laughs> This is, uh, he's, these are 25 a piece. Mm -hmm. $25 a piece. Nermal, oh. Nermal, who he hated that cat. Mm -hmm. He was always picking on Nermal. But didn't she like him? Well, that's a boy. Oh, but he had a little girlfriend that he yeah. liked, didn't he? He had a little girlfriend. Mm. They haven't made her yet. Oh, okay. I guess. And Odie. And then they got a mouth change -out. Yeah, it's, it's a mouth tough. plate. Yeah, <laughs> that's just weird. What is that other thing up there? For a wagging tail, the tail changes oh out. Oh my god! <laughs> at Poor least Odie, he treated Odie bad. At least they uh, they look like classic designs. Yeah. Now, we're jumping to executive replicas, and they've been talking about this for a minute that okay. they're going to do. You know, the old cheesy movies, and they had wonky, stupid-looking robots, guys inside of suits that looked yeah. like they were made out of water heaters and stuff? Yeah. They're going to do a line of robot toys based on that. Oh, no. And this is the first one from Executive Replica, and that's the Venusian War Robot from the film uh, Target Earth, 1954. I don't think okay. I saw that one. Yeah. The, he's a, about seven and a half inches tall, one-twelfth scale. Mm-hmm. 250 wow. for 12th scale. He lights up and that's not die case. Batteries not included. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure how jointed this thing is. It's hard to tell from mm -hmm. the imagery. It's going to be a lot of joints in yeah. a robot. They also did it in 6th scale. Oh boy, don't want to know the price on that. Yeah, so there's the 6th scale version, Venusian War Robot. 350 mm. for the 6th scale. And it says, for materials, it says various material types. And I don't know what that means. You're going to get so, a little of this and a little it's a of cool, that. It's a cool concept, but the price is kind of throw me. Yeah. I'm like, oh, I don't know, man. 12 yeah. scale, 250 Ooh. Yeah. I don't know. i have to see what people think about that. You know, throw your concepts, your ideas in the comment section. Let mm -hmm. me know what you think. Hey, look at that. Yeah. Snoop. Yeah, it's uh, Funko, of course, and that is uh, Snoop Dogg being, uh, says it's Snoop on the Stoop as opposed to Elf on the Shelf. Okay. So Snoop on the Stoop, I guess he could sit on the curb. He should have a little doobie then. Okay. <laughs> I don't think even Funko going to go that far. No, they wouldn't go that far. You have to, you'll have to customize it. Uh, some Gundam stuff here. Okay. The Char's Zaku II. Mm-hmm. The uh, Gundam RX-78, couple of c classic Gundams, as Pops. Mm. 
Hey. Halloween Mickey Mouse. I like that. Yeah. You know I love Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I like the color schemes on it. Yeah. And of course if they mini. The, uh, this has oh. to be there has to be a mini. Oh, look at you. Yeah. You know, this is the stuff that makes Yes. Me, that makes me keep buying. pulls you back in. <laughs> Every time I say I'm done, they do something. Yeah. Okay. Sully. Oh, okay. From uh Monsters, big Monsters Incorporated, yes. Monsters, Inc., yeah. And Mike. Oh, and the big eyeball. Mike, yeah. Mm -hmm. Billy Crystal. Mm -hmm. They're the voice. Elvira, of course. Oh, that looks cute. Yeah, Elvira and Gonk. And there is a pop ride for Elvira as well. I remember when they first did her, um, and then it sold out and people went crazy. She was at the show trying to sign. She got freaked out. She, she they, did. They, she ran. They scared her. She yeah, ran away. I, mean, she I would too. The mass of mobs of geeky looking people. Pop up. All sweaty with them. shirts that don't fit. <laughs> wanting her to sign their Funko Pops. Probably want them to sign a stomach. Oh, sign God. their stomach. Wow. Mm -hmm. You never know. Hey, look at that. Rudolph. 60th Another anniversary, one. Rudolph. Oh, I got the set. Not and, the original, that second wave set, uh -huh. that re-release. And 60th anniversary Bumble. Oh, I might get With that. little snowflakes on them. Mm -hmm. And that'll wrap up Funko for the time being. We're going to look at Four Horsemen. Another wave. Oh, Another what? big wave. This is the Blue Shield Soldier. He's going to run you $70. You know, what does just, that do? He's the soldier from uh, Four Horsemen. Oh. You know, oh, they're, they're, oh. they're mm -hmm. uh, legions. Mm. So you just got an army bill. Yeah. Put him with something. Oh. Frost Ogre is 75. That's his accessories. Uh -huh. I have the accessory images for some of them. They do come with a lot of stuff. They do. They're just expensive. Yeah. There is oh, the wow. gold skeleton, 55. That looks good. Yeah. I like that. The shadow centaur is 85. Hmm. There is uh, Kai Pacha, is 50. Kai Pacha comes with a lot of stuff too. You can make him a, a person, you can make him an ogre. You can swap his heads. Yeah. He's got keys. Mm hmm. To unlock the door. There is uh, Losef. Losef is 55. This is a two pack. Malignancy of the Goblin Gob Hollow, two pack, is 90. Hmm. And their accessories are as such. He can change out his shoes. <laughs> and he doesn't, I guess he's stuck with his shoes. He doesn't get shoes, everybody. Sorry. Mm -hmm. And then uh, Spirit Bender is 50 bucks. That's a lot for one time. Yeah, but that, I mean, it's like every other week they got this big wave. I don't know how anyone keeps up. Mm. Zoo. Is 50. And then you see all the zoo's uh, stuff. He can become like a, a, a spirit, a yeah, a ghost, ghost or, or something whatever. there, yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's interesting stuff. It is, and it always just, looks good. And even when you go to the shows and you see it, they look really yeah. good. Boy, that's a lot. It is. Even at $55, that's a lot of money if you want the whole way. Yeah, 50, 50, anywhere from 50 to 85 a piece, you know. Mm. We're going to jump to NECA. Doing a Beetlejuice. Mm -hmm. This is the 88 Beetlejuice. This is not the modern incarnation. Right. Quarter scale. Oh, okay. Okay, that's a quarter scale, mm -hmm. and it is also mixed media. Mm. 130 okay. suggested retail for a Beetlejuice. They didn't go up too much on that because their quarter yeah. scale, I think it was like 120, 125, yeah. something like that. And they're showing you... Um, they're not showing accessories on this yet, if there are any. I assume there would be, because I'm thinking like how they did the quarter scale turtles and Mike yeah, Myers and all Beetle that stuff. Yeah, but did Beetlejuice have accessories? Uh, I don't know. Give him hand change out something. <laughs> oh, come <laughs> <So>. on. <laughs> you want him to just give him stuff. Yeah, just give him stuff. <laughs> I don't remember, because I haven't seen the film in a long time. I'm sure there's things that you can put with him. Okay. And we'll pop over to Super 7 here. Mm. That is Conan. Yeah. Uh, Conan based on the comic books. Mm -hmm. But King Conan? No, not King Conan. Oh. Just regular Conan. Oh, okay. He ain't a king yet. Mm. 55, of course, because it's Ultimates. Yeah. And here's one that'll throw you. That is Cull from the comics. Yeah. Cull the Conqueror. 
and his war sandals. Ugh. <laughs> you get your toes your toes chopped off. That's what happens. Mm -hmm. But that's different. Yeah. Also different coming from Super Seven is the Misfits. The uh, the Misfits is Jerry only, and these are done on body. They, they look uh, like Motu figures. Yeah. All right, so that's something different for them. These are going to run you thirty a piece. What size is that? Like five inch. Oh. They're going to run you thirty a piece. So mm -hmm. there's uh, the dancing. Mm hmm. The fiend. I promise you, none of these guys are this buff in real life. Mm -hmm. Glenn Danzing. Who's that? Sean. Da Danzing again. Sham Hain, whatever. Sam Hain. Oh, so it's two words. Yes. Okay. Sam Hain. And then Danzing again without the uh, bloody mess on him. Oh, okay. And a microphone. And a microphone. All he needs now is two turntables. And that are those music musicians? Yes. Oh. <laughs> I thought that was their own intellectual property. No, no, no. No. Oh, okay. But um yeah, they, that's I don't know how I feel about those. <laughs> Anyways, that's going to do it. That's all? That's that's a, that's going to do it for today. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, thoughts? Mm -hmm. Anything there? But you know I like those pops. Which ones? I actually like the um the Rudolph and oh, the Bumble no. and the two Mickey Mouse. Well, Mickey and Minnie. Mickey and Minnie. That's it. I like mm -hmm. those. I mean, you know, I'm into that. Okay. I like the Garfield, but I don't think I would get that. I like the Garfield, too, but again, at 25, it's not too bad. If they were at yeah. Ollie's, I, mean, yeah. I would get them. Hey, give them a chance. Or Five Below. <laughs> yeah, Five Below be selling stuff, too. And I'm feeling the Executive Replicas uh, classic robots of cinema, mm -hmm. but, but, man, that's expensive. Yeah, it is. That's uh, I'm surprised. Just shocked at the prices. Mm -hmm. But hey, guys, I'll throw it out there. Did you see anything that you liked? Tell us about it in the comments section down below. Please do give the video a thumbs up if you got anything out of it. We hope that you did. Share it if you can. Subscribe if you're new. All that good stuff. Yeah. And if that is it, then what more can we say? But thanks for watching, and we will see you again soon. Mm -hmm.